Hey guys, Soberies from Closed Circuit here. Today, we're going to talk a little bit about No Man's Sky next. I'd just like to start out and say that this isn't going to be a review piece or gameplay showing video by far, but instead me just voicing my thoughts on the game in its current state. My main goal is to just get my thoughts out and hopefully stimulate conversation and see what you guys have to think about it. With that said, let's move on. No Man's Sky is an open world space exploration game with aspects of survival, base building, and adventure, originally released by UK based studio Hello Games in 2016. I want to say that this game has by far exceeded the very baseline expectations that I've had established, given I did not have any sort of intense desires or hopes by far except to possibly enjoy this game in time with good friends and share some of the great sights that I've been taking in. I remember vividly how only last year I was playing the PS4 edition of the game, and even then it was a blast. The game had me immersed, and that usually doesn't really happen that much with me. I usually have like a very difficult time sitting still, sitting through a game, especially if they end up having tedious tasks and long travel times and things of that nature. But with No Man's Sky, it was different. I could seamlessly travel from planet to planet. Each new environment was testing me and my preparedness. That's what really gripped me. Every death taught me a lesson, and let me tell you, there were a lot. I guess that's just what happens though when you end up choosing survival mode for your very first playthrough without reading up on it beforehand. It didn't shake me though. I wanted to see what the No Man's Sky universe had to offer, and despite the densely packed cloud of hate hovering over the game, I felt that it was genuinely an enjoyable experience as it was, and I guess that may be an unpopular opinion, however it's an opinion nonetheless. Again, still, part of me wanted to enjoy it with my friends, and when the next update dropped in July, my wish was actually granted. I got to explore and chart beautiful planets with my friends, share some laughs, and, of course, make some credits. Everything felt like how I'd wanted it to be, and I guess, in a sense, the game ended up becoming the game No Man's Sky was truly meant to be. The only quarrel, though, that I have with it is through a conversation that I recently had with one of my friends concerning the multiplayer aspects of the game, in that it wasn't actually supposed to have any whatsoever on the final release. It seemed like it was a sudden change of direction indirectly brought on by the sheer amount of death threats and poor reviews on the game pre-next update. A quote from Sean Murray courtesy of The Guardian reads, I remember getting a death threat about the fact that there were butterflies in our original trailer, and you could see them as you walked past them, but there weren't any butterflies in the launch game. I remember thinking to myself, maybe when you're sending a death threat about butterflies in a game, you might be the bad guy. This spurred the No Man's Sky developers to de double their efforts in the game, however, and focus on developing with feedback from the people who play and enjoy the game in its current state, rather than those who spew hate at it aimlessly. Eventually, multiplayer or cooperative play was conceived, yet, once again, if you were to pay attention to the story of No Man's Sky, you would notice that there is a heavy and mentally draining theme of loneliness. You weren't meant to explore the star with your friends, nor were you meant to build bases and play the game in a survivalist fashion. You were meant to venture through space alone and travel with hopes of maybe encountering someone else in the vastness of it all. The story seems to not have been co-opted entirely for the change in design direction, but one could only wonder what that would result in for the Hello Games studio. That's all for now guys. Let me know what you think about the video, the game, or anything else down in the comments, and if you enjoyed this video, I would greatly appreciate it if you would click on that subscribe button. For now, Soberies signing off.